Hi, I'm Mark Zip from Crocker Farm Auction, and I'm here to talk about a really cool jug we'll be selling in our March 3rd auction. As you can see, it's interesting in a number of ways. First of all, it's got that great small size that people like, uh, about seven inches tall. Um, and secondly, it has this incredible uh, in size floral, floral design going around it. We have uh, here a, a tulip design extending around the base of the handle, um, all the way around uh, here on both sides of the handle. And then on the other side, we have a different design. It's a, it's a floral motif with kind of daisy-like uh, petals on the blossoms, interspersed with little narrow petals. Um, this design in particular um, you can find on very early pieces of, of stoneware made in, in New York State, primarily Albany, New York. Um, the Capron pottery as well as uh, the Cushman pottery and the uh, Boynton pottery all use variations of this uh, floral motif interspersed with other petals. Um, it's just a fantastic jug. Um, as you can see, probably the most interesting aspect of it is the the four handles. I mean, it has four handles, which is great. I mean, I think it's probably just the, the potter's uh, own artistic expression is the reason why he did these four handles. Um, it almost looks vase-like. Um, you can see when you hold it like this, it almost looks like there's a spider on top of it or something. But, um, you know, utilitarian-wise, uh, I, I don't know, you might, have, you might have had four handles to help the person grasp it. Or maybe if the person was a drunk, he could grab it easily with four handles or something. But um, it's just a very interesting piece. We believe it's a New York State piece, sometime dating uh, around the second quarter of the 19th century, somewhere, oh, 1820, 1840, somewhere in there. But uh, we're very excited to handle it. Um, you can see also on the handles it has a blue uh, dab on each, as well as at the terminals. Um, so yeah, another exciting example we'll be offering on March 3rd. Thank you.